Here's how much money Jam Moran has cost himself so far and how much he will lose if he gets dropped by Nike or Power A. Jam Moran signed a 193 million max rookie extension last summer. That contract will ultimately be worth 233 million with a variety of incentives. According to the terms of his contract, Jam Moran could earn those additional tens of millions if he wins MVP or Defensive Player of the Year or is named to an All NBA team this season. Those incentives are almost certainly off the table right now. As you likely know, Ja Moran has been the subject of a number of controversies in recent months. On March 4, 2023, Ja Moran was in an Instagram Live video that appeared to show him flashing a gun in Denver Area Strip Club. The NBA suspended Ja Moran for 8 games for conduct detrimental to the league. Few days after the Memphis Grizzlies season ended, Ja Moran appeared in another Instagram Live video in which he appears to be flashing another gun. The blowback from these combined incidents has almost certainly caused Ja Moran the bonus money. In other words, just in terms of NBA salary alone, Ja Moran has cost himself $40 million. On March 1st, 2023, just three days before the first gun video was made public, Ja Moran signed a multi-year endorsement deal with Power Aid. The deal made Ja the new face of Power Aid and called for him to appear in countless commercials, billboards, and store displays. When the deal was announced, Power A said it would spend $10 million on national TV commercials, digital ads, and radio spots. After the first gun incident, just days after the deal was announced, Power A paused all advertisements featuring Jar. The biggest brand to keep an eye on would be Nike. Jar signed a multi-year contract with Nike in 2019 that pays him $12 million a year. Nike released a signature Moran shoe in December. Jar is one of the only five players in the league with a signature shoe from Nike. In April 2023, Nike released a second shoe, the Ja One Hunger. Before this recent gun incident, the shoe giant publicly backed the Grizzlies guard. On Thursday, May 17, Nike removed the shoes from its website and app, but it was later released and sold out in minutes. If these recent controversies caused Nike and Power A to drop Ja Moran, citing moral clauses, when combined with a $40 million loss in NBA contract, Ja Moran's total losses will be more than $60 million. To his credit, after the first gun video, Ja Moran said he was taking time away to get help and take full responsibility for his terrible mistake. He's 23 years old and has already made millions of dollars while dealing with the pressure of being an NBA star and one of the faces of the league. Ja Moran may have not realized the gravity of what he was doing. Hopefully, his time away helps him move forward. As this year's NBA Finals is over, the NBA world is all waiting for Adam Silver's decision on Ja Moran. So let me know what you think in the comments down below. Do you think John Moran will be suspended for more than half of the season?